Yep, there it is here. Sleet's coming down, and what's unusual about this here coat of sleet, it's a real dirty color. Looking kind of yellow here on my viewfinder, but I don't bust my rear end. <laughs> it's not a clear ice at all. It's a real dirty color. Zoom out here. And on the truck. This truck must be dirty too. Hmm. <laughs> Go check out the Manman Mobile. Yeah, that's got a little more color to it. A little more whitish, but interesting. Show sure is cold. But it has gotten out here to the road and covered the road now. I right, check out my satellite dish. I had a feeling that it had frozen up. Not really. We had uh, uh, an accumulation of ice earlier this morning, about a tenth of an inch, just like they predicted. Now this stuff has covered the road. I just got out of the shower. I think that was the wrong time to take a shower. Okay. See how slick this is. Well, not so slick just yet, but <laughs> eh, I ain't gonna try it. Like I say, it's just now coming down pretty good and the temperature is dropping. Don't know what the temp is right at the moment. See me collecting on top of the house. But interesting. Interesting. It's not necessarily melting on the road right now. I think everybody's going to have to stay home right now. Yeah, but that's all right. I just got finished uh, cooking some deer chili. Had me a big old bowl of it. I'm feeling mighty warm right now. Inside and out. <laughs> yeah. So, a tiny bit of snow at the moment. A lot of sleep. Don't know what the accumulation is going to be right now. But it is a Sunday. This is the winter storm morning. And, uh, I wanted to get out there at Manly and build me a fire, but not right now. It's too daggum cold. I need a fire to get me warmed up so I can build a fire. Manland reporting here on Wednesday at 9.03 a.m. on a Wednesday, February the 16th. <coughs> oh, it ain't much better. <laughs> Let's take a looky see. All that sleet and a little bit of snow. There's still some snow falling. I'll turn this around so I can see what I'm pointing at. We've got some snow flurries coming down. Looking out toward the Manland Camp area. Man, all this sleet and snow and stuff. For some reason, at uh, some time, and I, I can't explain this weather phenomenon, but this sleet and stuff, okay has become solid so at some point the moisture that was in the sleet this used to be crunchy now it's all solid a solid sheet of ice it's not super slippery right now but I'm dragging my feet and there is nothing crunching up uh, sun was out earlier this morning around 7.30, 6.30, 7.30, somewhere in there. I took my pickup truck, I crunked it up, the Manland Mobile, along with the Wee Wee Mobile. Got them crunk up. They were, uh, they weren't happy to wake up in this cold, but, and, uh, I ran it, my truck, up and down the driveway, trying to break this stuff up to get some kind of traction. I made about four or five passes, and, well, let me show you the results. This is one of the tracks. Didn't break it up at all. Just made a slight indention. So now I've got ruts. 
watched Putnut's video. He is in, uh, let's see, the Bell Fountain area here in Mississippi. It's about a 30 minute drive from here on a normal day. Ooh, man, that wind is cold. All right, this is uh, the road that comes to Wee Wee's house. There's a look in that direction. Now, this is the look back in the direction where Highway 82 is at the end. It's about, uh, about a mile. And I'm eventually going to try to make it to uh, a place called 4D Grocery, which I'm not even sure if they're open or not. This is the tracks that most of the vehicles have been traveling. And if you keep it kind of slow, you can probably make it to the end of the road. But I haven't attempted that yet. This is Mr. Cox, our next door neighbor. And uh, there hasn't been any traffic except footprints. Need to get Weeby to call and check on them there. So, right now, as a, just after 9 a.m., oh, oh, the wind's picking up. They're saying it's something like 17 degrees right now. At least my truckometer said that, or the thermometer in my truck says it. And uh, I'm not dressed appropriately for this weather. Them boys in Canada, I tell you, <laughs> they'd be out here wearing short pants and short sleeves in this kind of weather, wouldn't they? I would get a fire going, but I think the wood is frozen. <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh